Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. Today we're making a super healthy oat bread and you won't need any yeast, you don't need to wait for it to rise, nothing like that. It's super simple, super easy and also very nutritious and made completely from plant-based ingredients. So you probably already have the ingredients at home, so make sure you keep watching if you want to know how to make it. So first things first, my oven is on 200 degrees Celsius or 400 degrees Fahrenheit and I have got two cups of oat flour. So that's simply just rolled oat blended into a flour consistency so that's in the bowl a teaspoon of salt I'm using pink Himalayan salt which I think has a really nice flavor and also some baking soda so I'm using two teaspoons of that and that is going to help a heavy flour like oats rise and be nice and fluffy just like real bread but much healthier so I'm just going to stir this up really quickly and then I'm adding 250 grams of coconut yogurt. I've also tried this with almond yogurt, so that really works as well. But you can also use some Greek yogurt if you want to make it higher in protein and if you're not vegan as well. So in to the bowl that goes. And then I've got one flax egg here. So that's one tablespoon of ground flax seeds soaked into three tablespoons of water. And this is gonna mimic a real egg and it will help bind everything together while also adding some more protein and fiber to this recipe. Two tablespoons of olive oil. I'm using this garlic infused olive oil, which has a really nice roasted garlic flavor. It's gonna add a bit of oomph to this recipe as well. A tablespoon of apple cider vinegar you can also use lemon juice as well because the acidity helps react with the baking soda and make again everything rise and nice and fluffy and then I'm simply just going to stir that up as well and also add some sweetener like some maple syrup or brown rice syrup but I don't really think it needs that it's just for people who like beans on the sweeter side so now you can see that this is a dough consistency and it's looking perfect, it's just smelling amazing. So I've got a bread pan which I've lined with these bread liners to make it easy to remove. I'm just going to place the dough in there and bake for 45 minutes until golden brown. So now that I've patted down the bread, I'm going to also add some seeds. So I've got some pumpkin seeds, which I'll just sprinkle on top. And also some hemp seeds. I love hemp seeds because they're full of protein, lots of healthy fats, just packed full of nutrition. So I'm gonna sprinkle that in too. Remove from the oven when it's golden brown on top and a skewer inserted comes out clean and slice and enjoy. You can store this bread in an airtight container for about four to five days. I love serving this either fresh or toasted with some jam or peanut butter or butter or avocado on top. Those are just a few of my favorite ways. It's so versatile and it's also freezer friendly if you can't finish it within those days. If you did like this video, make sure you give it a thumbs up and subscribe if you want to see more healthy recipes like this. Thanks for watching.